So with this, right here, the little white tip, that's what was in the um, in the bag. They had two spare ones. Uh, it's called a something spacer. Let me, uh, I think it's a recoil spring spacer. I think that's what it's called. I'll check up, check up on it real quick. Just using the uh, Smith and Wesson manual. Yeah, it's called the recoil spacer. Okay. So that's the spare things that are in there. To put it back together, just put that on there. Now with this, you put the bolt on before you put the recoil spring in. You put it just over it, like not right here, and slide it back. Because it's got to go over there. Then it'll fall down. I'll take this and put it in here, facing down, like that, oops, yeah, that, that reminds me, you gotta keep your hand down on the bolt so that it doesn't go forward, okay, and just push this, hold on, there, and then just push that down, I already did it, push it down so that it locks into the little notch, and then here, you just um, push it back and then lock the thing back by just pushing the little notch up. Okay, and then that's what you get. Alright, then just push this back in a little hole. out in the camera I can't do it it's too far away yeah it's got a, uh, a four inch barrel I believe again just hold on Usually it doesn't really matter um, to dry fire it, but uh, I'm just gonna do that so you guys can see it. Here it is now for the sights. Just push this up here, just so that you can see what kind of sights it's got. They're not all that bad, and having a mount on it and everything you can put a lot of accessories on it there's a little Smith & Wesson I actually have a Smith & Wesson knife in my pocket right now it's got the same seal it's harder to see on that but yeah, there and right here um, yeah so 22 long on the side, right there. Adjustable rear sight. It's got the little screw, screw right there. Yeah, um, I do like the easiness of it. Um, to reload. By the way, I'm putting. 
putting this in my pocket and just keeping my hand just off of it for the barrel. I mean, not the barrel, the magazine. Wrong way. Um, yeah, the barrel is, um, really heavy, which is good on a target pistol. This weighs, um, 35 ounces, I believe. Just wait a second and I'll get the... without the magazine in it. This does have the magazine in it, so. Let's see what this says. Well, zero it in. Okay, it says two pounds. 2.9 ounces. So that's 2 pounds would be 32 ounces and then 32 ounces plus 2.9 ounces is 34.9 which is basically 35 which is what I said. So yeah. They must have been talking about with the barrel in it not loaded because I could have swore they said um, with the barrel or why do I keep seeing that with the magazine out of it? Okay. Well, there it is. If you have any questions, just uh, leave a comment. It says Smith & Wesson 22A. Model 22A1 is how they put it. I like the uh, the ergonomics on it. It's very nice. <laughs>